Good morning and it is an early one at this special park because it's Earth Day, which means also happy birthday Animal Kingdom. 20 years old. 20 years old. And so we're here because we love Animal Kingdom, but we're also here because our good friend Lauren's dad worked on this park. He was part of the opening team, like they lived here because of this. Yeah. When this was being developed. So we're here. There's probably going to be a speech or something. That'll probably be the only end. Some, some special merchandise, some special signs. But we are ready. You hear the music? It sounds extra good. All right, they got cool pamphlets out. We need a stack of times, guys, for our friends back in California. Wow. Wow, already blown away by the day. Look, Look at this that. Times Guide. It's like a matte finish. It's like a timeline. Of the history. Oh, oh, that's this party for the planet. I think that's a thing that they're doing. This is like their summer fest that's going on all summer. Well, outside of the Discovery Trading Company, here's the line for the exclusive merch. We told our friends, mom, that we would try to get the pins for her because they, like we said, they lived here and when they were designing it, but he it goes way back here. We also have the luxury of living here. Yeah. And like all other anniversary merchandise, it usually ends up in the shops again after. Yeah. Not guaranteed though. Right. Not, there's a, there's a level of risk there. Right. They've they've been in the shops for weeks. for weeks. No. Darla, Look at that right there. That she would say, "Go enjoy." Oh yeah. The day. And I think we should head that way then. Yeah. So they do have the stage set up here. They were gonna do the 10:30 speech here, probably with the park ambassadors, but. There's a rain in the forecast, so they moved this to the Harambe Theater, which is already a standby line according to Twitter. So we're gonna run over there, but look how cool this sign is. So Fast Pass is gonna be D23 members, and we're gonna get in this queue here for standby. Not bad, because they haven't filtered us in yet, Sarah. So I think we're still good. I think that is D23 going in, and we're going in here. We'll see if we get in. It's been a fun time. There's a really cold breeze because it's about to pour. <laughs> But uh, this will be fun. I think I overheard somebody said they took out a section of the seating to put a stage there. So maybe we'll do standing room in the middle. We'll see. We'll see. It's gonna be a good day. We're in. They, I'm sorry. They cut off the line right behind us, so we're in, and we just saw Joe Rodian walk past the door. Wow. Oh my God, we're literally in the last row. Of this. But look at this setup. This is a cool shot though. Wow, look at the production set right there. There's a live stream and a stage. Woo! Some classic Animal Kingdom entertainment. how excited we are to have you here today to help us celebrate not only Earth Day, but the 20th anniversary of this incredible park. Where else can you fly on a banshee, ride a train through Mount Everest, experience an authentic African safari, go back in time to prehistoric worlds, and enjoy two Broadway-style musicals based off of Disney films, all in one day. Since our opening day here, our guests have enjoyed the Disney Conservation Fund efforts through voluntary contributions they have made around the park and beyond. Magic Kingdom harnesses the power of dreams. Epcot celebrates the energy of hope. Hollywood Studios communicates the extraordinary power of story. And the Animal Kingdom, well, it does all of that plus a little bit more. Virtually every guest that's here comments on how this theme park is absolutely a true work of art. Hundreds of Imagineers and thousands of cast members have contributed to that effort. So, 20 years. 20 years of Animal Kingdom is really not just 20 years of the existence of a park. 
It's 20 years of life. But Disney's Animal Kingdom is founded on unchanging values. Uh, the value of nature itself as a treasure that cannot be traded. Uh, and the value of adventure, of the great change that happens when we step out into something new, something unfamiliar. And the value of a personal call to action. That a story told by Disney can be a story about you. Enjoy Party for the Planet and explore all of the adventures that this wondrous place has to offer. Do I want to stream or no? Remember we went like we purged? Okay. If this was us like seven years ago in our college program, we would have collected all that up. You want to see it up close? Okay. Okay, so on top of today being the 20th anniversary, today's also the debut of a lot that's going on because today started like the summer or like, it's only like a month long. Party for the Planet. It's a lot of cool events that Animal Kingdom's doing. The new bird show debuts the up today. One that we talked about the other day. Yeah, that, that starts, starts today. today. But also, but, a little world called Pandora. They have these like, it's a scientist that's walking around in one of these like big suits. I don't really know the exact. If you saw the movie, it's basically like those giant exoskeleton suits that they walk around in. I don't know how close it is to the ones in the movies, but it's a 10 foot one. So hopefully. We're gonna go over there really quick and see if we can spot one. Um, there's some. Uh, there's a bunch of other social media accounts that are meeting up at 12:30 that we're gonna go say hi to um, at, the at the Tree of Life. But well, I want to see this 10-foot suit. Look at there's an event going on. Oh yeah. That's the real deal. That's the real deal. That's the real social media people. Yeah. Not not just us us YouTubers that live down the street that come here every day after work. Whether I had this camera or not, I'd be here having fun. <laughs> we went over here to see to find the suit. The, I, I got the name of the Pandora Conservation Initiative Utility Suit, and it only comes out twice a day right now. So yeah, it's so 9:45 and 11:45. So we missed it, but that's okay. Fun. We can come back. We'll come back and see it sometime. I think we have to go on a safari because I'm wearing this hat. I think so too. Okay, so that was by definition a whirlwind. Did you get any footage? No. We went to a, a small meetup in front of Tree of Life with a bunch of other Instagram and YouTube accounts. So it was cool. We'll they were all great people. We'll link it because we'll be in their videos. <laughs> yeah, we'll put a bunch of the accounts down below. So check them out. They were all super nice. A lot of them, some of them we've seen their videos before. A lot of them we just met for the first time. Yeah. And then we realized how exhausted and hot we are and windy it is. So we, we were talking so much. We got two giant waters and a frappuccino. Need that caffeine kick. Now we're waiting for Jill. Yeah. Okay, we don't know what's going on with those monkeys. But we're gonna try to get closer, but I wanted to shoot a little bit right here just in case they stop when we go over there. But there's one right there. See? They've been doing this for like 20 minutes. That was about 30 minutes ago. We walked over here and so you heard it, right? <laughs> yeah, I've I vlogged it from over there. And they were like playing. Now they're just chilling. Like if you did the math there, yes, we've literally done nothing for the past hour. <laughs> we went from standing over there to standing over here, but... That's just the plan. That's just what we're doing. Just, we're just taking it day by day, moment by moment, living our best selves. Do you like my hat? I do not like your hat. I wish I, should, I, wish I wore my hat. We could have matched your hat. You've been getting so many compliments on this today, though. Yeah, and like, the funny thing is, is like, people are like, that's a great hat. I'm like, they, half the time they didn't realize it was a Disney hat. I know. Like, it says what they did on the side, and they sell, this is the 28 main symbol. We found ourselves in the gift shop after Dinosaur and I looked up and it was the first time I've ever looked up in this gift shop and my mind is literally... Ryan, oh, where are you? Look at all these little trinkets. And they go the whole way. But then look. Look at this old Mickey. This is all up top. Okay. This is all up top inside this, this gift shop after Dinosaur. Hello. 
Thank you, Pocahontas. Thank you. If you have a great day. Sorry about the impromptu uh, impromptu introduction. Jill got here. That's what I was trying to say. Jill's here. We can't celebrate Earth Day without Jill. She's like, she's like the most personal, the closest. The wilderness needs to be explored. Yes. Come when on. I think of Jill, I think of Earth. It's a fact, and I always have. Like she's just she's that kind of person in your life, and we wouldn't have it any other way. Nothing like a five-minute standby wait for tough to be a bug when you got fast passes. Completely necessary. I don't know what that is, but we're fading and we're fading fast. <laughs> All of us. Just want a churro. Jill? I want a pretzel. I want, I want a burger. A burger. I want a burger. I'm gonna or go ice big. Ice cream, anything. Burger and ice cream. Ice cream in a burger. Mickey pretzel. Oh, Cheese. Mickey pretzel. Oh, we're going on safari. I don't know. I think shortly after, maybe? Yeah. I don't know. We might call it a day soon. We have been away, so we have been here since park opened. No, fine. We don't want to be away from Eve too long, and I should go on a run even though my back is killing me. But I need that dopey with everybody walking around with their marathon medals. It makes me super jealous um, that I missed out on all the fun of doing the, the dark side challenge. But doing it next year though. Oh, we could. Animals here in the forest. Things. A couple of sides. We're gonna go through good deals. We're gonna grill we think. Didn't know we had a grill in our apartment, did you? Because we've never used it. Don't know how it works. Learning experience. Say that to my frying pan. Uh, learning experience. We have three gas grills in our apartment complex. Communal. Yeah, one was being used, one was broken, one was. I don't know what was going on with it, but we were not using it. So, looks like we're gonna use the old cast iron. Alright. Well, also had some hair looks crazy, so ah! if you don't mind that. Ah! Oh, Eve can yeah. smell the burgers. How I need your help. When I'm like grilling or deep frying something or like or frying something inside, like a burger or something, how do I not have my apartment smell like that for like the next week? 
Let me know down below. But I'm Melinda. starving. Yeah, I guess. We'll figure it out. This is the most glamorous. Yeah, it's this is the most glamorous I've ever looked in the vlog. I went on a run. Did we say that I went on a run yesterday? I think so, yeah. No more laziness. Yeah. I had a bad month. No more. There's not enough time now. <laughs> the way I run is I run as far away from where I am need to end as possible because then I have to go home. Like, so if I'm running two miles, I run exactly one mile away from home, so I have to go home. Um, I got three miles away from my apartment, I turn around, I was like, I'll go three back, maybe I'll go five back to eight. But I turn around, I start running, all of a sudden I start feeling drizzles, I'm like, oh no. So it's raining on me, but then I look up and the most magical thing happened. Off in the distance, I saw Happily Ever After, Illuminations, and Star Wars Spectacular all going off at the same time. <laughs> and I felt like I could run 60, 60 more miles. <laughs> but I have to go take care of myself. Yes. Alrighty everyone. We are going to say goodnight here. It's been a long day. The weekend went by very, very quickly for us though and we're kind of pooped. It's before midnight. We're headed to bed. Um, Dapper Day is next weekend so we actually just finalized who we're going to be Disney bounding and all that good stuff. So. We're excited already for for those days coming up. We will see you tomorrow. He wants nothing to do with this. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>